Contrast Enhanced Harmonic Endoscopic Ultrasound Guided Radio Frequency Ablation of Hepatocellular Carcinoma A New Horizon in Endohepatology Disclosures None Contrast enhanced harmonic imaging enhances the vascularity of lesion at EUS by intravenous infusion of contrast agent. It improves the success of EUS guided tumor ablation. Here we report a case of contrast enhanced harmonic EUS guided RFA of HCC located in the cardiac lobe of liver. Forty-eight year old male is a known case of HBV related cirrhosis on entecavir for three years. And routine follow-up is alpha fetoprotein was elevated. Hence, dynamic MRI was performed. It showed heterogeneously hyperintense lesion on T2, measuring 2 cross 1.6 cm in the caudate lobe of the liver, with enhancement pattern suggestive of hepatocellular carcinoma. There are multiple cysts in the group, both kidneys. Liver transplantation as definite treatment was refused by the patient. Thus, multidisciplinary team suggested to perform RFA of HCC. Percutaneous ablation of lesion was technically challenging owing to its deep location and proximity to the IVC. Hence, contrast enhanced EUS guided RFA of HCC was considered. Linear echo endoscope was passed into the stomach. Coarse echo texture of liver parenchyma was noted with ill-defined hypoechoic lesion measuring 2 cross 2 cm in the caudate lobe of liver. Contrast enhanced harmonic US performed by injecting sonoview contrast after focusing the lesion showed heterogeneous enhancement soon after the injection of contrast suggesting HCC. U.S. guided radio frequency ablation electrode is a 19 gauge needle with a 1 cm active part. Needle insulation and a water cooling system ensures direct ablation in the area of interest. U.S. guided RFA needle was inserted into the lesion. 22 watt monopolar current was delivered under direct U.S. vision. Ablation was continued until echogenic changes noted in all areas of the lesion. Contrast enhanced harmonic US was performed following the ablation. In this lesion appeared hypoechoic compared to surrounding parenchyma indicating complete ablation. Follow up MRI at 3 months revealed resolution of the lesion in the caudate lobe without any fresh lesion in the liver. Alpha fetoprotein level also became normal. To conclude, Contrast enhanced harmonic US guided radio frequency ablation is a safe and effective alternative to percutaneous ablation. It can be considered for deep seated liver lesions as it helps in their visualization and confirmation of ablation.